Uh, another race we're uh, watching closely this morning, the heated battle for L.A. County Sheriff. KTLA's Megan Tellis live in downtown L.A. with the latest on this race. You're not frozen. Good morning. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I am frozen. That's the problem. It is, if you actually pan down, you can see I have my scarf that is actually now a skirt right under the belly. So there you have it. Hey, it was a long night for everyone. And now this morning, the votes are still coming in. Who will be the sheriff of L.A. County Sheriff's Department? Will it be another term for Alex Villanueva or will it be his opponent? The new guy in town, Robert Luna. That is the question. The numbers are in. Let's go ahead and pop them up on the screen right now. At least so far, it looks like 42% of the votes have been counted. And right now, Robert Luna continues to be in the lead with 57% of the votes compared to Villanueva's 43%. We heard from both candidates last night at their rallies right here in Los Angeles, surrounded by their supporters. Listen. Oh, I love the way the numbers are trending. We. Uh They've done two updates, and both updates we've closed the gap, and there's a lot of updates to go. So this the night is very young. It has been very clear to me, uh, going again through the entire county, listening to our residents, that they want change. Uh, and if you look at back in the primary, 70% of the people that voted voted for a change at the top of the sheriff's department. Four years ago, Villanueva was a retired L.A. County Sheriff Department lieutenant. He won in an upset victory over then Sheriff Jim McDonald, becoming the first to unseat an incumbent in over 100 years. Villanueva is ready for a second term despite four years of continued controversies and what some call combativeness with the L.A. County Board of Supervisors. Villanueva has been accused of using a secretive public corruption unit he formed to attack political enemies and covering up multiple scandals from the public. Public. The sheriff says he's just been a target of liberal politicians and activists. As for Robert Luna, he retired last year after spending 36 years with Long Beach Police Department, his last seven as the chief. He's hoping to now lead the largest sheriff's department in our nation. His biggest struggle during this race, name recognition. Despite many not familiar with Robert Luna, he has received endorsements from all five L.A. County supervisors and the candidates he beat in the June primaries. If he wins, he takes over next month. Luna has led Villanueva in the polls for months now. How does this race end? That is the question. I'll keep you updated. Outside of the L.A. County Sheriff's Department in downtown, I'm Megan Tellis. Frank and Jess back to you in Hollywood. All right.